Hey everyone, welcome back to new video. In this video, we are going to discuss about the exporting and importing of employees in Odoo 16. So it is very easy to manage the importing and exporting of the employees. So importing and exporting is mainly done while migrating your systems or um, while onboarding and offboarding takes place in an organization. So if you want to just down download the employee list, it is very easy and you can just download the entire or the records in single or bulk in Odoo 16 employee module. And importing of uh, employees is then while we are just migrating the records of employees or in a case, uh, like let's walk through an example, like uh, you need to just onboard a certain number of employees. So we have to just enter the data of the employees, right? So in such cases, we may just excel on the records of the employee in the Excel sheet or CSV file and we just upload that to the Odoo 16 employee module. So as you upload the file, you will get the entire details of the employee in Odoo 16. So it is very easy to manage the importing and exporting in Odoo 16. So let's see how to do that. So let's get into the employee module. As you get into the employee module, you could find all the employees who works in your organization. So all these employees belongs to my company San Francisco. Now, my company San Francisco need to onboard a few more employees. So, uh, as uh, the employees are onboarding, we know that we have to keep them under the employee module. So, in order to manage with the employees, uh, like exporting and, and importing of the employees, you can just switch into the list view. And let me choose uh, uh, the employee uh, from here. As I choose the employee over here, you can see we can see a button called action where we can export the employee. So in order to export the employee, you can just click on export button and this would allow you to export the data of the employee. So Odo will suggest the available fields and the fields to export. So you can also uh, export the data in both XLS format and CSV format. And if you want to just uh, get a compatible importing and exporting of the data, you can just use I want to update the data import compatible and export so order will suggest the fields to export so i'm using uh this suggested field and going to export the field so as i just export the field here you can see um the details will be configured in the excel sheet and uh, it's downloaded now if you want to just import any employee which means new employee you can uh, easily import the reports so let me fill out the details over here uh, here you can provide the name and all so here let me provide the name of the employee and afterwards you can set the job id parent id country id activity user everything and you can also provide the email afterwards you can set the building uh, i mean work location and you can also provide the phone number okay so let me save the file and let's import this employee so in order to import the employee you can just go to the uh, Odoo platform and under the favorites we can see import record and this would allow you to import the record so if you want to import the template for employees you can just click on this button and if you want to just upload the file uh, choose the upload file button and that would allow you to upload the file so let's choose the file and let's open that so as you open the file here you can see the file columns and Odoo fields and you can see Odoo has automatically configured everything over here and you can just click on test now uh, everything seems to be valid and you can just click on import so that you can see two records will be successfully imported and as you have just imported the file, all the um, yeah details I have uh, filled here by Odoo. So here you can find the uh, details that we have given such as name, job ID, then it's um, the department as well as phone number, company and work mail. So it is very easy to manage with the employees uh, like the importing and exporting. So importing and exporting of the employee is mainly then um, while uh, we are doing onboarding and offboarding 
in an organization. It is simple to get the employee records in a bulk with a single click. So hope this concept is clear for you. As always, stay awesome and thank you for watching the video.